Hello friends, in this video, we are going to see uh, the counters. In our previous video, we saw the count up and in this video, we will see the countdown. First of all, we will head over to the OpenPLG editor. Thereafter, I will create a new folder which I will name as counter down and I will select the folder. Let's just keep the PoE name as it is and change the language as letter diagram. Then enter OK. As always, I will create two power rails one on the left side and one on the right side. Then we will again go to standard function blocks and we will use the countdown block or CTD for short. As you can see, the down can be used to signal when a count has reached zero on counting down from a preset value. Again, in this block, the only integer is CV, which is count value, and PV, which is preset value. And CD is the countdown and LD is also boolean. First of all, I will add some variables here. preset value, the type of the preset value will be integer. Then after, we need to add some coils and contacts here. Then I need to add two open contacts here, which is CD and pulse. I will join the pins.
and for last I need to add a variable block here which will be named as the preset value I also need to give the initial value of the preset value now I will enter 6 here and then after I guess I will start the simulation The simulation is complete. I will click on the debug classes and drag this up. As you can see, that the output is true. And I will force true to the countdown and then I will force true and false First of all, I will force true to the reset. When I force true, you can see that the output is false and CV is showing the value of 6, which is the preset value. Now again, when I force it to false, the Q and CV is indicating the same values. I will start forcing the pulse to true and forcing the pulse to false. Now the CV starts counting down. First it was 6 and now it's 5. Again when I force it to true and again it false, the CV is 4, so on and so forth until the CV is 0. and the coil Q is true. Then again, I will reset it and the counter value is starting down count. This is how a countdown a down counter works. Thank you for watching the video.